Good morning, guys. So today we're gonna do a get ready with me, but I'm at my kitchen table in DC. I'm gonna find a place to prop my phone up and then we'll get started. This is a good spot, I think. So we're starting the day with the brown sugar shaken espresso. Always my go-to order. If I don't know what to get or Sometimes I try like the new coffees, but last time I did that, it was disgusting. It was the new apple crisp oat milk or whatever it was. You know, if you know, you know, but it was not, not the drink to get. So basically for my like foundation, if you want to call it that, I use Air Minerals Complexion Rescue. I'm very pale in the winter, so I hate that, but that's where these come in, the bronzy drops from Drunk Elephant. Do a little mix, Saru. It just adds so much tone. Makes me look alive again. We don't wanna be looking dead, but let me put y'all on something. The Rare Beauty Eye Brightener, it is amazing. It feels like ice when it touches your skin, so it like automatically helps with like those puffy under eyes. I leave it there while I'm doing my other concealer. Okay, so this is for the rest of my concealer, I use the Benefit Boing Industrial Strength Concealer. I swear by this stuff too. Like it actually does work. And I used to not have a makeup routine. Like four years ago, I didn't have a makeup routine. I used like the Origins Tinted Moisturizer and then I threw on like powder and blush and called it a day. Which is fine <laughs> if that's what works for you. But it wasn't working for me back then. I still looked horrible. So, my sister really started the journey of finding makeup. Someone needed to inspire me. Cause like my cousin that I grew up with, she's basically like my sister. She would just use foundation and I had, I didn't really like the feeling of foundation and I didn't want to have to do a full face of makeup every single day. So I didn't use foundation all the time, just for a special event. So this routine benefits me in the fact that it looks natural and it gives me like a natural, like dewy glow. I like how I'm literally using my phone as my mirror right now. Okay, look at that. I probably should get one of those little eye beauty blenders. Look at that. Can you not tell how much that like brightened my eyes up? Which I don't really have bad um, eye bags usually, but right now they kind of look purple for some reason. Should I be concerned? Maybe. Or maybe I'm just really sleep deprived, which that is the case here. Okay, I think that's looking fine. Boom. Look at that. I'm exhausted, y'all. Now that that part's done, I like to go in with bronzer. Don't judge me, I know I need a new one. Um, I've been using the Tarte Sugar Rush bronzer. This stuff is, you know, supporting my goal for makeup. I love the golden natural look. Natural. You know, the summer vibe. The summer golden bronze makeup look. And that's what this stuff does, and I'm here for it. That's why this, it looks like that. You can see I'm here for it. Um, so the powder, I'm using the Benefit Hello Happy Velvet Powder Foundation. This stuff is awesome. Always gives me a nice, like, silky look um, at the end. And it helps, like, kind of just set everything that you've just done. Um, I kind of use this to like make sure the um, bronzer is like blended in. Also, if you're a makeup expert watching this, please don't judge me. Okay, so like I said, gives me like that silky finish while not, while it's not like too overwhelming. It's supposed to work like a foundation, which it does. Back when I didn't have a makeup routine, I would do concealer and then this. Now we're gonna do blush. And this Bare Minerals Blonzer is my favorite. Sometimes I smile because I want it to just like really poof on my cheek. In the winter, I love a good nose blush. Actually, who am I kidding? I love it year round. Don't judge me. It just kind of gives you like that sweet like windburn look. <laughs> okay, maybe that's a bad way of putting it. Now for the highlighter, I use Rare Beauty um, highlighter. I love this color. 
I, I feel like my face, my skin has like golden undertones. So I really like to hone in on that by using this Rare Beauty um, highlighter. And yes, I use my finger. I don't know why. Um, why am I like speechless right now? Okay, see that? Let me do my nose too. Trust me, I don't leave it on just the tip. I go up on the bridge too. And make sure it's really blended in so that way like when you're out and about, it doesn't look like you're trying to wear a no nose highlighter. Okay, so there's that. I'm gonna go ahead and use my setting spray. So I use the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Setting Spray. I swear by this, like actually. Anytime I put this on, if it rains outside, if it's super hot, this makes your makeup last. And I'm not kidding, like it actually will. I was in Disney a couple weeks ago. At the end of the day, my makeup still looked basically fresh. I mean, you could tell like when I had just woken up and I had makeup on, but when I came home and looked, my makeup was still intact. Mm. It's perfect. So, for fun, before I put on my mascara, Thrive Cosmetics, I will always use for eye stuff. Um, so this is their um, eyeshadow stick, I think it's called. Pretty good if you know you're gonna cry on a certain day or if you're gonna go do something pretty active. Um, this is a great little eyeshadow stick. I love it. I always go kind of like I'm doing a little bit of eyeliner. So I go on the lash line right there. Open your eye. I go, I like to go underneath too. It just helps like give a little bit of pop to your eye. Go in like the arch of my eye over here. Okay. Woo! It feels kind of sticky because it's waterproof. But when you start blending it in, it feels better. So now you go up here, you just kind of like start blending it in. You can also do this with your finger if you want like a little bit less color. Cosmetics, liquid lash extensions are amazing. I've been using this for like years. I want to make sure they're both like the same length. So I was looking a little weird. Maybe it's just me doing it in the camera. Anyways, so there it is. My very simple and natural looking makeup routine. by anyone this is just honestly my favorite products currently if you have any recommendations leave them in the comments below